Hey, Cameron McKenzie here, and I wanted to show you how to rename a GitLab branch. As you can see, I've got my GitLab repository right here, and if I take a look at the three branches in this repository, well, you'll notice that my bug fix is named bog fix. So I need to change that. The problem is I've already done a git pull, a git clone, a git fetch. So if I go over here and say git branch dash a, you'll notice that that bog fix is already in my local machine. So what's the approach that you typically use here? Well, it's fairly straightforward. All you have to do is git do uh, git branch dash m command, which will change the branch. I always find it easier to run this if you're on the branch you want to change. So I'm going to do a git switch and switch to the bog fix branch. Now notice I use switch not checkout. Uh, we don't use checkout anymore. We use switch since 2020. So stop using checkout. Now that I'm on the bog fix branch, I can just issue the rename command, which is just git branch dash m is the big change. And I'll call this bug fix, not bug f oh, f u x. I'm not going to pronounce that. I'm going to get demonetized git branch dash m bug fix, not bog fix. And all of a sudden, if I do a git branch dash a, look at all of the branches here, you'll see that, well, now I'm on the bug fix branch. I am no longer on the bog fix branch. Okay, so what's the next step? Well, the problem is that bog fix branch is still up here. If I do a refresh over on GitLab, I still got that bog fix branch. So that is annoying me. So why not delete it? So git push origin dash dash delete and delete the bog fix. That's what you do. So you might want to do a git pull before you do all of these crazy operations so that you've got the latest code locally before you actually blitz what's on the server. But right now, if I look at my branches, you can see that's the restful link to all my branches. Bog fix is gone, but I don't have bug fix. So I guess I've now got to push that bug fix, that renamed git branch up. And so that's just git push origin. Make sure you set origin as the upstream. That's what the dash u does. Say bug fix, not bug fox, not bog fix. And now that's going to push the bug fixed origin. If I come over here to GitLab, do the refresh, look at that boom, we've got the bug fix up on the server. We have renamed the git branch. We have renamed it locally and we have renamed the git branch on GitLab. And that's pretty darn good. Now, if you enjoyed that fast tutorial, why don't you head over to the serverside.com. I'm the editor in chief over there. We've got lots of great tutorials on GitLab, DevOps tools, continuous integration, software development, and everything that has to do with cloud native computing. If you're interested in my personal antics, you can always follow me on Twitter at CameronMCNZ. And please subscribe on the YouTube.